I'm so excited for tomorrow. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be like the second time I went to a, a convention in general. Makeup artistry is something that I have a passion for right now. I love color. Like, my favorite color is the rainbow. I don't have a preference to, to any color at all. Um, rainbow isn't just one color though. The rainbow is all colors. <laughs> I am um, three shades and then some. Look okay, at pink, pink, and pinker. <laughs> Ma, do you approve of uh, Antoine right. being a makeup artist? Yes. I'm using it right now as a, to my advantage. <laughs> when did you figure out that Antoine was gay? Since he started walking. As soon as he started walking, he didn't walk, he tippy toe and he and he he always used his hands as wings like this that's how he walked i swear <laughs> he right that time yeah if you see happy feet one yeah they call him happy feet because that's how he walked and i said mm, let's try this mm, mm, mm. pat i love my son and like i've always told said about all my children that all I want for them is to be happy and with a great person at their side. It, it don't have to, um, their gender don't have anything to do I with it. That she starts. Hey, Graham. Are you okay with Antoine yes. being gay? No. You have your other yes. stuff in your bag, Mama? Yes. Yeah, they say, like, okay. I'm okay with him being gay. I'm okay. What's wrong with that? What's mom like? Mm, at first I thought of mom as God when I was a child. Why God? She was a person that I trust with my life in the very beginning. And she was someone that I worship and was very dear to me when I was younger but now I find her more as you know as someone I really care deeply for and as a friend as well um my face is okay mm -hmm. you can you put blush on? Yeah. I like it. Yeah. I like it. It started when I was doing my thesis and I decided to do a photography project where I'm creating transformations in my face. I decided to go to the field of cosmetics and I fell in love with it and this is exactly what I wanted to do because in my art I was so character oriented and I decided to find work in it and to continue doing it. You think people will judge you because you're in the makeup artistry? I mean it's gonna happen. People you know calling you freak or not approving. Describe that. Well that is a man of few words. I mean, he's never the one who always approves of anything I do, unless it's what he but likes. I'm all grown up, but we always have been butting heads. But he's still my father, and I still respect him and everything. But I'm all grown up. Are you okay with Anton being gay? Yes, I am. Do you have to say yes, I'm okay with him being gay? Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, this is a comedy out here. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes for the for the heterosexual male is not easy say the complete sentence. Yes, I'm okay with Antoine being gay. Big deal. It's your choice. So no to everyone uh, that is watching this. Homosexuality is not a choice. It is something you are born with. Okay, no 
nobody's born with that. Nobody was born with one leg. Nobody was born with one eye. Of course people could be born you, with you, one you, eye, you, one leg. You came out and yes, you, you was people. normal. You, everything was right. You just grew up and that, I don't know, you just, that's within you, not within because you grow up. I, I, I came out of my, my, my baby's, uh, my mama's uh, stomach and I was a Fruit Loop. No, I was gay. I just came out, I was gay. I was, that don't, that don't make sense. I was, um, and then raised in a heterosexual community, but then I experienced gay, um, the gay community as well throughout my life. But I didn't choose it. I was born with it. It was not born with it. It was something that you grew up to it. And that's what happens. This all started when you was in college. It's not because I uh, was in college. Yeah, it was started when you was in college. It didn't start when I was in college. Huh? It didn't start when I was in college. Okay. I had felt these feelings when I was very young. No, nah, it started when you was in college. <laughs> I mean, I really love this. This is awesome. I'm getting, I'm meeting different types of makeup from different types of cosmetic companies. I'm learning a lot. Um, it's just, it's so overwhelming. It's an amazing experience. I'm um, Antoine Jarrell um, Rivera from Facebook. We met. Um, actually, um, put my fan art on the page. Yeah. It's, it's a pleasure to meet you finally. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, I'm here. <laughs> oh my god, we gotta take a picture. Zion, take a picture. Oh, this is my brother. He's, he's documenting me. Oh, I see. I wasn't sure if he was with the show or with you. Yeah, take a picture of us. I do feel like I belong here. Definitely do. As an artist and as a makeup artist. Um, No, that wasn't so hard. So now that the makeups are gone, I'm back to reality. You know, being the normal me, the typical human being. Because <laughs> normally when I when I put makeup, it's like I feel like a different person at times, and almost like a superhero in a way. You know, you have your alter ego and everything because of the transformation you live with. Once you put it on. So that's why you have pictures to remember and, you know, to cherish. 
The magic of makeup is never gone because you always can reapply it again, especially since I'm the magician of the whole thing. <laughs>